A serious undertone. A great view of our broadcast locations in a downtown Atlanta. We're all set to bring you today's action. It's game four of the Eastern Conference quarterfinals. Glad you could join us today. Hello, everyone. With Chris Weber and Greg Anthony, I'm Kevin Harlan. We'll be hearing from our Hall of Famer on the sideline, David Aldridge. D.A., take it away. Well, guys, Kemba Walker is a multiple-time All-Star. But from his first seasons in the league, stardom was not assured. Even he said, I never saw myself playing at this level. There were times I didn't know if I even belonged in the NBA. I guess you could say I'm surprised. Now, Kevin, every player has those doubts at the beginning, but few overcome them the way Kemba has. David, he's come a long way. Thank you. And now the opening lineup for Boston. Walker and Brown, they're manning the backcourt. Hayward at small forward with Tatum at the four. And it's Tice in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for Atlanta, Hunter at the three with Collins at the four. Young and Herter make up the backcourt. And it's Capella in at the five down low. So off the tip, it's Boston. Now here's Walker. He kicks to Brown. Connects from three-point range. Wow, wonderful court awareness that time. You can count on Walker to find the open man. Herder passes to Collins. Young against Brown. Young inside. That one's off. He starts the game with a miss. Three-pointer. Hayward. A shot. No good. And Atlanta will come the other way. Here's Young. And he uses the glass on the layup. And having to respect Young's deep range defensively. Hard to close off the lane. Boston's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Now, here's Walker, guarded closer, and he comes up with the deuce. And, and once he got to the 10, I, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. I mean, you had to bring much faster help than that. Now, here's Hunter. Nice ball movement here by Atlanta. Shot clock at six. Got a piece of it. Here's Young. It's hauled in by Brown. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. That's a two-pointer from Walker. Rebound by the Hawks. They're feeling confident after Tuesday's big win. And that one was all about offensive execution, running your plays, picking your spots. And as long as you do that, you put yourself in a good position to win, no matter if you're home or away. So it's the Hawks now. Following the miss by Kemba Walker. It's stolen by Tice. And here's Walker. Pass to Tatum beyond the arc. And no good that time. And Atlanta will come the other way. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. And the dunk by Capella. Yeah, Kevin, I love the high activity Capella brings. Someone that really brings it on the offensive glass. Walker finds Hayward. Rebounded by Capella. The Hawks trailing. Hunter, the pass to Capella. Misses the layup. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D. Avoiding fouling and, and got in the perfect position to alter the shot. And no hesitation to get to the ball. He uses his height advantage to convert the easy. The Celtics shooting their first free throw tonight. Now about three minutes gone in the first quarter. 
They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. The Atlanta shooting their first foul shots of the night here. He misses the free throw. Pretty obvious Young believes in his ability. A, a fearless shooter who also does a good job at orchestrating the offense. He hits the second from the line. And it's Walker with the ball, bringing it up for the Celtics. Passes it to Tatum. Here's Tice to the inside. Brown, and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Well, Brown is just fearless, Kevin. I mean, especially when it comes to going right into the contact. The Celtics have gone one for one, making their previous attempt at the line. Shoot two. the first and, and for Brown it's about consistently improving we've seen flashes from him but now it's time for him to meet expectations and Brown drops them both the Hawks trail by five Young outside over Hayward. Young passes to Herter. That's in coming off the assist from Young. How about the vision from the crafty little guard. Young excels at realizing when his guys have clean looks. There's the pass to Tice. Again, the miss by the Celtics. For Atlanta, they've gone three of seven from the field since we've gotten underway. It's stolen by Brown. To Walker. Outside Tatum. Shoots over Capella. A new 14 for Boston. Brown outside. Tice. It's good on the putback. Tice has got five now. Hard work and soft hands, guys. That, that's what made that play possible. No simple offensive rebound there. Going for the tip-in. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. That'll put Trey Young on the line. That's on Jalen Brown. The Atlanta shooting their third free throw attempt of the game. Celtics with the lead. Walker dishes to Tatum. Nice ball movement by Boston. And Capella sends it back. He seems to improve his shot blocking every year. I mean, Capella is outstanding at using his lip to swat away shots. Herder, no good. He's forcing things a little bit in this quarter, settling for shots that he'd be better off passing up. Down kicks to Walker. Pass to Tatum. A shot by Hayward, wide open, offline with his three. Atlanta's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Now, here's Hunter. Defended by Hayward, and two shots coming up at the line as he gets fouled on the shot. And when Hunter attacks like that, it really puts the defense in a tough spot. Love it when he takes the initiative. The Hawks shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight.
and the first one drops. An athletic forward with, with a versatile skill set. Hunter has also proven he can come up big in big moments. Tied up with that one. Austin's gone a meager one of six from three point land since we got started tonight. Here's Walker. Good work defensively by Capella. You know, I'd have been very impressed if he had got that one to go. Tough D. Here's Herder. Guarded by Walker. Here's Capella. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. And so it's Walker with it who brings it up for Boston. And slam dunk by Tatum. And, and going right to the rim. Love the attack mindset and the ability to finish strong. And Young kicks to Hunter. In the corner. Herter with it. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Tice. Tice has got six rebounds here tonight. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Well, Tatum is lengthy. I mean, long. I mean, you think you got him defended. He, he ends up getting to the foul line. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And the Hawks making a change here. Edmonds checked in. scoring gene but with efficiency both from the field and the line young passes to Deadman. here's Herder guarded by Walker Deadman with it six to shoot three pointer hands it from downtown Herder's got five and that's exactly what he's looking for draining the triple Walker finds Hayward. Here's Tice. Here's Walker. And that one's good. His second basket of four, shooting 50%. And although he's smaller, Walker doesn't fear going inside. I mean, he knows he can get his shot over anyone. Outside, Cowan. Passes it to Hunter. Now, Deadman. the pass to Herter. Unloads. Hunter no good. Oh, you expect him to make those. They've got to do more to get a hand in his face next time. Hayward right side. Young with the steal. Over Tatum. Collins trying to break free. Will not go. This is off the front eye. Austin leading by four. Now, here's Walker. Doesn't get it to drop for him. Atlanta's gone, just one of four from three-point range here in the first. And here is Hunter. Baseline jumper. Pass to Deadman. Back to Herter. Here's the teardrop. Deadman kicks to Young. And no good. Great D that time from Tatum. Hayward's got space. Buries the 20-footer. And the Celtics lead by six. His first make, and, you know, maybe that will get him going. Round against Young. Here's Herter. Walker with some nice D. The Celtics shooting at around 42% since the opening tip. Count it. And now an eight-point Celtic lead. Well, well, I'll say this. Tatum gives you options in the open court because he can score from anywhere. Timeout, timeout. And Atlanta calls their first timeout of the game. They're trying to stem the tide here. Uh, yeah, they have to regroup it and revisit their strategy at the defensive end.
So Boston going with almost an entire new group. Cantor is checked in for Daniel Tice. Jimmy Ojale comes in for Gordon Hayward. Smart's checked in for Brown. And Brad Wanamaker subbed in for Kemba Walker. Now here's Jones. Pass to Graham. Knocked loose. Stolen by Smart. And another fast break chance here for the Celtics. Here we go. Ojale passes to Cannon. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Passes to Capella. Here's Graham. Guarded by Smart. And it's Graham missing. And so it's Smart. He'll bring up the ball for Boston. Ten-point lead. Goes up on the block, and it's wide right. It's off the rim. Atlanta's gone just one of four from three-point range here in the first. It's Young on the wing, guarded by Smart. Here's Jones. That's in, coming off the assist from Young. That's just a product of good pass work. I mean, nice team basketball right there. Outside Tatum. Here's the three, but they recover it. The shot's good from Cantor. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Yeah, they've been very aggressive, and they've taken early control of this game. Now, here's Capella. He dishes it to Reddish. Shot clock at six. And easy two points on the layup. I like that pick play. I mean, you can see how easily it makes it for him to get to the cup. Smart passes to Cannon. And here is Tatum. Outside, Smart. Kept alive by Boston. Cantor's shot is off. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D. Avoiding fouling and, and gotten the perfect position to alter the shot. Here's Ojale. It's hauled in by Clint Capella. And he's got to do a better job making the D pay for their mistakes. Graham, the pass to Reddish. Shoots the three, and the last second attempt doesn't fall. Uh, really working on the technique defensively. Tatum showing good fundamentals, good discipline. And so it's Boston in the driver's seat, up eight points at the end of the quarter. A terrific tempo and a great pace. The fast break has been a central part of their offense. Right back after this break. A unique upbringing for Clint Capella. Spent years in a welfare orphanage in Switzerland. He said he never imagined he'd come this far. Even as a kid, I wasn't even dreaming about that far. I would say that it's even past my dreams. I mean, now I'm just living the moment, trying to work hard, uh, as hard as I can, and just enjoy the present. Enjoy the present. Just an inspiring story, Greg. It gives you perspective on why you should be grateful for everything you have. Kevin, without a doubt, Capella's upbringing helped shape him, and, and the hard work he continues to put in is really admirable. And we welcome you back to Game 4 on 2K Sports. And the Celtics guys, what jumps out to you, stance-wise? Well, you can see these guys are unafraid to take chances defensively. Yeah, it's a gambling style that pays off, G.A., keeping things in disarray for that offense. In a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. On the court for the Celtics, Smart and Brown outside on the wings. Ojale is out there with Ennis Cantor. And it's Wanamaker in at the point. And, and that's how you build confidence in your shot. Smart, able to set his feet off the catch and shoot. Young from outside, buries the long-range jumper. 
Young's got nine points. Well, he doesn't play around. If the buck is there for him, he's going to get it. Smart dishes to Cantor. Back to Smart. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. I like Smart using his size advantage on the interior. Nice work out there. This is his first trip to the line tonight. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. A six foot four, 220 pounds. Marcus Smart might be the most physically imposing point guard in the league, especially with his fiery approach to the game. Second free throw, no good. The Hawks trail by 10. A minute and a half gone here in the second quarter. There's the pass to Capella. Collins in the post. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Chalk up two there. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. Celtics leading by eight. Smart passes to Cantor. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. Back to Smart. Shoots from the baseline. Collins grabs the miss. Collins has got seven rebounds in the game. Here's Rush. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. The Hawks have only one missed free throw. They've had five attempts and made four of them. throw good from Reddish. So after making the first, he goes one for two. Here's Young. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That's on Jalen Brown. You know, you, you can't be overzealous inside when you guard Young. You got to be better at contesting without foul. First one falls. He's off on the second. Celtics leading by six. On the wing, Brown. He's got five. And the shot is good. Brown's got seven points in the game. Oh, you love the level of concentration Brown maintains. I mean, taking the hit well and finishing in style. Young from outside. Kept alive. And it's put back up and in by Capella. Oh, great timing. He is one tough customer on that offensive glass. You know, it's like he has a sixth sense of where that rebound is going. Now, here's Cantor. The dish to Brown. Atlanta with the rebound. Cabela's got his seventh rebound here tonight. 
Young right side kicks it to Capella. Collins against Brown. Collins dishes to Young. That three off the mark. Well, he's got a great stroke. That one almost dropped. And it's Brown missing. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. Cantor, the pass to Wanamaker. You're smart. Hits it from three-point range. Smart's got eight points here in this quarter. I mean, it took him a long time to get into the flow of the game, but the points are starting to come for him. Here's Herter, guarded by Smart. Herter passes to Reddish. And it's denied. And now, with the fast break, Smart with the ball. Rebound, Atlanta. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Basket good. 12 points for Trey Young. You know, fending off the defense well there. Young solid at just being crafty enough in these types of situations. Here's Wanamaker. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Here's Cantor. Back to Wanamaker. And again, Boston with the triple. You, you, how can you forget about him? I mean, he's not going to miss that open of a look. Brown against Young. He feeds it to Capella, and it's blocked. Down low, here's Cantor, and Cantor throws it down. Oh, what incredible precision. Brown cutting the D to pieces with his pass. The Hawks trail by 12. Time call here. Timeout. The Hawks decide to talk it over. Trying to find some answers offensively. Some bad shot selection as well as some bad luck. I mean, that's not going to help you score points. Hunters checked in for the Hawks. And then for Boston. Williams comes in for Shemi Ojale. And Walker subbed in for Brad Wanamaker. Pass to Hunter. Williams with the block. A main staple in Williams' game. That sixth sense for when to rise up and deter those shots. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. Here's Herter. Good work defensively by Smart. And it's Walker with the ball, bringing it up for the Boston Celtics. The 12-point lead, their biggest of the game. Here's Brown. And the rejection by Collins. Now, here's Hunter, guarded by Smart. Pass to Hunter. Stolen by Smart. A finish. And slam dunk by Smart. That's just elite defense by Smart. Seizing the opportunity and taking it the other way. To the middle. Stolen by Smart. And now it's Brown running. He can go all the way. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. You know, I love how he absorbs the foul and still had a chance to knock that one down. The Celtics have shot five of six at the foul line tonight. Take a break. Take a break. 
Two shots. That free throw good from Brown. So for the Hawks. Wayne Dedman comes in for Clint Capella. And it's Teague in for Young. The Celtics also changing it up. Daniel Tice is checked in for Ennis Cantor. Tatum comes in for Robert Williams. And Gordon Hayward is subbed in for Smart. And Brown drops them both. The Hawks trail by 16. Teague surveying the D. Here's Herder, guarded by Tatum. Passes it to Collins. Lock at six. They need this one. Shoots over Walker. Collins, good. Oh, the timing couldn't have been better on that assist. Austin leading by 14. Brown outside. The pass to Tice. Up top, Walker. Teague covering. Walker's shot is off. He doesn't get the finish, but the D's got to be quicker to rotate and stop him from getting to the rim. Hunter, the pass to Herter. Stolen by Walker. Teardrop shot. It's good. Walker's got his third basket of the night right there. And Walker is downright insane with the ball. Really showing off his insane ball handling abilities. That's to Deadman. Here's Hunter. And Boston with the rebound. Tice has got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. There's Walker with the three. Knocks down the three ball. Walker's got five points in the quarter. When his three-point shooting improved a few years ago, uh, Walker's career, uh, that, that's when his game went to a whole new level. It's rebounded by Tice. Celtics leading by 19. Brown outside. Back to Walker. They get a hand on it. Tatum finds Walker. Now here's Tatum. Pass to Tice. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Hayward. That one's not going to go. So Atlanta will take it the other way. Here's Teague. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Kemba Walker picks one up. Well, when Teague has a step or two on the drive, he'll shield the ball and do his best to draw contact. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. one is off and as you would expect from the way he plays Teague is a terrific free throw shooter and the Hawks making a change here Graham's checked in and a change for the Celtics Williams is checked in and he sinks the second Here's the Celtics with the ball. They're on a 19 to 7 run. Walker against T. Shots good by Walker. Walker's got seven points for the quarter. This system is set up perfectly for him today. I mean, it's allowing him to find a lot of good shots. Teague against Walker. But Teague is just so elusive on the court that he'll catch you leaning and force you to pick up a foul. This is his second trip to the free throw line. First free throw is good. Jones checked in for Dwayne Dedman. <laughs> and 
And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Here's Walker. 11 points in the game. He kicks it to Brown. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. So far, he's hit all of his shots at the foul line, going four for four. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw, no good. Second free throw, good. And so it's Teague with it. He'll bring it up for the Atlanta Hawks. 19-point game. Outside Cowan. And that comes off the assist by Jeff Teague. Six points for John Cowan. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Here is Williams. No points in the game yet for him. And it's Walker penetrating. And that one drops for him. And the Celtics lead by 19. Uh, with the run he's on in the second quarter, I mean, this field goal percentage is tremendous right now. Atlanta's gotten into trouble with the three ball in the second quarter, only hitting one of five attempts. Teague with the ball. Hayward grabs the board and not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. Yeah, Greg, that's just great defense, forcing his man into a difficult attempt. Uh, a little surprise he took the jump shot with nobody around him. He could have attacked the basket. Tatum against T. Excellent D there from Williams. Brown outside. Outside Tatum. Good for another basket for him. Number four today. He's four of eight. Uh, refusing to let the defender alter his shot. Tatum's focus and drive is what helps him finish hard shots. Now here's Teague. Can't cash in from the left block. Here's Brown and finished off by Brown. Attacking in transition, the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yeah, you can tell they love to get out and run when the opportunity is there. Teague against Walker. Williams with the block. Well, he has to work harder to get a good high percentage look. I mean, he's been taking some bad shots out there. Well, part of their game plan was to block out the noise and just stay focused. Well, Greg, their, their poise has been tremendous. I mean, excellent at both ends has them increasing this lead. Teague, and he makes that one. Teague's got five now. And Teague just so creative in how he finishes around tough D when it's thrown his way. From deep, and no good on the last second attempt this time. Kemba Walker firing on all cylinders for the Boston Celtics. He finishes with nine points in the quarter. The D is having all sorts of problems with him. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks, Kevin. Here with head coach Brad Stevens. Coach, what did you think was the main edge you had? Well, I thought defensively we were a lot better, um, and then that led to some offense. But obviously, we're playing a bunch of skilled guys, and we're able to spread the floor, and that's helpful. You have to make them work at both ends. Thanks, Coach. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. And we'll be right back after halftime to start the third quarter. See you in just a bit. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. SRO. Standing room only. Ooh, nice. I'm your host, Ernie Johnson. We've got Shaq here. We've got Kenny the Jet. Looking at Boston. 
to keep the series competitive, they know they have to win tonight. And that pressure has brought out the best in them. They don't look like a team that's willing to go down three games to one in this series. They want to even it up. Kenny, what's your take on Boston so far? They've done a lot of things well, but the way they've taken care of the basketball, valuing each possession so critical to the tempo, so crucial to the offensive flow. They've got a great rhythm, as smart and as safe as they're playing. They made it clear they're not going to beat themselves today. And Shaq, what'd you see from Atlanta? Well, they struggled in a number of areas. Protecting the rim is really at the top of this. They haven't made that a priority. They haven't put forth a whole lot of effort. You got to protect the rim. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See everybody with Kevin Harlan. And we're with you again as our round one coverage continues. What a game we're seeing from Kemba Walker. And the way that he has helped out with the ball movement has been a difference maker early on. Yeah, Greg, and that's somewhat of a surprise, I mean, but he's been really patient and unselfish. NBA playoffs, round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. Herter the two with Hunter at the three. Clint Capella is out there with Collins, and it's Young in at the point. That's the group starting the second half for Lloyd Pierce. And although he's smaller, Young willing to battle inside and shows you he can score through contact. For Atlanta, they have gone 9 of 13 from the line. So it's the Celtics now. Earlier in the game, they held a 25 point lead. Left side, Walker. That's in. He's 7 for 12 now in the game. Dan Walker gets it going. He's tenacious. Feels like he could take on anyone. Now Young. It's rebounded by Tice. Tice has got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Here's Hunter. That's in coming off the assist from Young. Young's got three assists in the game. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. And stolen by Hunter. Passes it to Herter for three. Another three for Atlanta. Yeah, these defenders had better start closing down on shooting. Now, here's Walker. 15 points in the game. And there's the pass to Tatum. Got a hand on it. Just a little over 90 seconds gone in the third quarter. Here's Herter. Eight points for him. He makes it off the glass. Herter's got ten. Well, that makes him four for five. I mean, uh, I think that's pretty good numbers. I mean, they've got to be pleased with how things are playing off so far. Now, here's Brown. Back to Walker. A three. That counts. He's put up 13 shots, and he's had eight of those go in. 
And Walker is what we call thirsty. He's thinking of firing as soon as he gets the rock. Great presence of mind from the point guard. Here's Hunter. He's got five. And it's Young. That time on the assist by Collin. He's got 17. And that's an example of playing big, adapting to the situation. Well, you have difficult finish, but if you expected him to back down, better think again. Now, here's Brown. 12 points for him. That's tipped and stolen by Hunter. And here's the fast break. He can't get that one. Some solid defense from Brown. And a wide open look for Walker. A new 14 for Boston. The Hawks trail by 15. Young outside. Poke loose. Walker against Young. Here's Brown. And it's in there. And the Celtics lead by 17. Uh, with great physical and athletic tools, Brown's adept at pushing past contact. Brown against Young. For the three. Made that one. It's his seventh of the contest. Seven for 15 from the floor. Well, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. Brown outside. Three-pointer connects from three-point range. Brown's got 17 now. Now, this is the fire you love seeing. Now, Brown doesn't back down from anyone. He relishes getting his revenge. Capella, the pass to Hunter. And here's Walker. He's got 18. Vicious to Tatum. Here's Young. Pops in the layup for two. Young's got 10 points here in the second half. And a terrific effort there by Young. R really all night. The, the defense has tried to make adjustments, but he's just stayed one step ahead of him. Young with the steal. Last break here. Here come the Hawks. Here's Herter. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's on Jalen Brown. The Hawks have made 10 of their 14 tries at the free throw line in the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Good on both. Oh, he's never rattled at the strike. Always has that nice soft touch on his free throw. Walker against Young. Brown outside. No good on the triple. The Hawks trail by 11. Pass to Herter. And a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. And how about the awareness Hunter possesses? Understands when one of his guys has an opportunity. Walker the pass to Tice. On the wing, Brown. Hayward outside. Six on the shot clock. Launches it. Rebounded by the Hawks. Capella's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Here's Herder, guarded by Tatum. Out to the right wing. Hunter, the pass to Capella. Here's Herder. He's got 14, and he's able to get it back. They get it back on its way from Young for two, and again, it's Atlanta. And this is why Young is so dangerous. He just gets that shot off so fast before the defense can react. Now, here's Walker, and stolen by Hunter. 
Kicks to Young. Pass to Herter. Outside Collins. At the top of the key, Hunter. From past the arc. It's rebounded by Tice. Tice has got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. Hayward dishes to Walker. Collins against Tatum. Brown outside. Over Young. And it's Brown missing. The Hawks trail by seven. And it's Hunter with the jam. And what I admire about Hunter is that opportunistic attitude. This kid just makes things happen. So the Celtics call timeout. They're first. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. Well, the defensive intensity has to pick up, and I'm sure Coach is going to let them know that. Wayne Dedman's checked in for the Hawks. Shemi Ojale's checked in for the Celtics. Marcus Smart comes in for Jalen Brown. On defense, Atlanta trailing by five. Here's Walker. Another miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. Here's Herter. That's in, coming off the assist from Young. Young's got five assists tonight. Well, it's all about the assist on that play. He puts it in the perfect spot. Now here's Walker. 18 points for him. Hangs in the air. That one, no good. Collins with some nice deeds. And so it's Young who brings it up for Atlanta. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Young's got 26. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. with the ball. Ten points for him. To the inside. Six to shoot. Here's Tatum. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Uh, well, that's the thing. Tatum's sneaky. He understands how to put the defender at a disadvantage. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. One falls for Tatum. Both teams deciding to change it up. Yeah. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Now Young. He's got 26. Out to the right wing. Here's Graham. He nails it. And we're tied up. And you've got to give them a lot of credit for just battling back into this game. Yeah, Greg, there's no panic in them. I mean, staring at a big deficit, they still kept their poise and went to work. Here's Wanamaker. Pass to Ogil. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now.
first one falls for. Makes both free throws. Impeccable from the line since halftime. Atlanta's gotten the three point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. Outside, Jones. Young with no one around. And trying for the go ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Knock loose. And here's Tatum for three. Down goes basket number six for him this game. He's taken 12 shots and made half of them. Three-point shooting since the half has been about as good as you could ask for. Outside, Jones. Now the pass to Young. Deadman trying to break free. That's him, and the Celtic lead is cut back down to two with those points from Young. And they're going to have to pay closer attention to him beyond the arc. I mean, he's got two threes in this half, a total of three overall. Count that one from Ojale. The real. Come at us, and we're coming right back at you. <laughs> Let's talk about the great competition going on. That's what makes a matchup like this so much fun to watch. Young for three. Another three for Atlanta. He's leaning on the three-point shot a little more in this half. Only had one before the break, but he's got three of them since then. Outside, smart. Back to Tatum. Good, and Smart gets the assist. 18 points for Jason Tatum. I mean, you see the strength of Tatum already. Broad shoulders and able to make shots through contact. And Young kicks to Graham. Pass to Hunter. Let's the three fly. Rebound, Boston. And until he starts knocking down some shots, I don't think the deficit's going to get me small. And it's good for two. Now it's a six-point Celtic lead. And after really leaning on that three-point shot in the first half, seeming like they're uh, just getting away from it here in the second. More of the shots coming from the interior. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And there, just through activity, Hunter keeps the pressure on the defense. These are his third and fourth free-throw attempts of the game. Two. The first free throw is good. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. The Atlanta making some changes. Reddish, he's checked in for Dwayne Dedman, and it's Teague in for Trey Young. Brown is checked in for the Celtics. And so he hits both. Austin leading by four. Wanamaker the pass to Cantor. Now here's Smart. Teague covering. Bounce pass from Smart. Cantor the pass to Wanamaker. No good from outside. And so Graham will bring it up for Atlanta. There's 47 seconds left in the third quarter. And he'll shoot free throws here. Clearly fouled on that shot that time. The whistle blowing. And Boston called for the foul. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw good from Reddish. And the Hawks making a change here. Capella's checked in. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. 
We'll see if they want to trade two for one here. Got to time up that clock to do so. We've got 33 seconds left to play here in the third. You're smart. That one doesn't drop. And Atlanta will come the other way. Reddish with the ball. Picked up by Brown. And the shot goes down. So impressive. The, the fortitude. The will to battle back. But it did take a lot of energy to get here. Yeah, true. But we'll see if they can keep forging ahead. For now, we got to give them credit for coming back. up a three and the last second attempt does not go in for him Trey Young he's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for the Atlanta Hawks he was a true standout at the offensive end both with his scoring and his passing we've got more in store for you right after this and let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game and he's always been uh, the favorite to bag this honor. These kind of feeds are his bread and butter. Control the pace. Get it to the right guy at the right time. These requirements top the list if you're a good point guard. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. And a look at the five for the Celtics to start the fourth quarter. Smart and Brown outside on the wings. Ojale is out there with Ennis Cancer. And it's Wanamaker in at the point guard position. good on that one. And he's good on the second. And you can sense that the pressure might have gotten to him a little bit, but he did do enough to put them in the lead. Pass to Collins. Graham surveying the floor to take the lead, and it's good on the layup. Not an easy finish right there, but a beautiful move to give himself just enough space to get in close and knock it down. You're smart. Banked in off the glass. And the Celtics lead by one. Uh, I like Smart being aggressive right time, getting into the lane, using his power and speed to his advantage. Back to Young. Some solid defense from Brown. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. Well, that's why he's out there right now. In situations like this, he stands tall to prevent points. Here's Wanamaker. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. It's going to be on Trey Young. free throw is good. Williams, he's checked in for Boston. That 
misses, so he splits the free throws. Well, I mean, a semi-productive trip to the free throw line, but we'll see whether or not it costs him. That is dishes to Capella. Tipped away. And so it looks like the Hawks will retain possession here. to Reddish. Five to shoot. Williams with the block. Inside. Here's Ojale. And the rejection by Collins. Young against Brown. Here's Graham. The Hawks again can't hit. And so Wanamaker will bring it up for Boston. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. The pass to Smart. Reddish grabs the rebound. For Atlanta, they've gone 1 of 4 since the end of the third quarter. That's off the pass. Brown wide open. He fires. It's good from long range. Brown's got 20. Oh, you love to see Brown knock down the three ball, showing great strides and improving his range. Young passes to Capella, and the dunk by Capella. Such incredible hops for a center. Look, it allows him to hold his own against any other five in the league. Here's Wanamaker. How's that for an answer? Right back with the dunk. Just rubbing it in their faces with that dunk. <laughs> he is never going to take his foot off the pedal. What a performer this guy is. He relishes the chance to hammer it down. Reddish, and he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. And there's the call. Foul on Boston. And he can't get the first one. Good on the second free throw. And one of the problems in the first half, that shoddy work at the free throw line. They needed to fix that, and they've been much improved since the break. Now here's Williams. Back to Smart. Shot clock at six. And he gets the bucket. Smart's got four points in the quarter. I mean, he's got the size and the strength to finish amongst the big men. That's why he does it. Smart. Built to last in the paint. Time called here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. Every time out, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. Now, that's what coaches are paid to do, right? I mean, curious to see what they go with here. Teague, he's checked in for Trey Young. Austin also with the sub. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for Brown. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Thank you, guys. I got a chance to listen in on what Lloyd Pierce was saying to the team. He said, if we're going to pull this out, we have to do it as a team. We have to rely on one another, trust one another, and help one another. Let's go get this. Kevin, back to you. And Tatum the bucket on the assist from Smart. 20 points for Jason Tatum. Yeah, three consecutive field goals have come right at the rim. The D had better start buckling down. Teague drives in. Williams with the block. And pushing it up, here's Boston. Tatum leading the charge. Pass to Ogilvie from outside the arc. Reddish grabs the rebound. Not his best game, but they're still getting it done collectively. Puts up a three. Another shot. Collins. 
A rebound by the Celtics. Earlier in the game, they held a 25-point lead. Here's Smart. Drills the three-pointer. Smart's got nine points now in just the second half. A good look there, and he didn't waste it. His second three of the game. Here's Grant, guarded by Smart. Off target at the rim. Here's Wanamaker. It's hauled in by Clint Capella. Capella's got 13 rebounds in the game. Class eating. Graham kicks the tee. Pass to Reddish. And it's blocked. The long arm of the law. Tatum prohibiting that shot from ever having a chance. And a new group in for the Celtics. Daniel Tice is checked in for Williams. Hayward comes in for Shemi Ojale. Jalen Brown's checked in for Smart. And it's Kimba Walker in for Brad Wanamaker. Just five on the clock. A nice shot by Teague. And after an abysmal first half from the field, the shot's now starting to fall. Here's Walker. To the paint. Here's Hayward. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Oh, man, right there. Hayward willing to sacrifice his body in traffic to make the play. down the first one. There's been a lot of evolution to Hayward's game. I mean, during his career. I'm not sure too many people saw him becoming the terrific player he is today. Hayward hits them both. The Hawks trail by eight. Here's Teague. Shoots over Brown. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That's on Jalen Brown. Marcus Marks check in for Brown. Shooting two. First one drops. And they are making it look easy at the free throw line here in the second half. And so he makes both from the line. Celtics leading by six. Outside Tatum. Out to Hayward. The three sinks the triple. Hayward's got five points in the quarter. You know, some scouts thought Tatum had tunnel vision looking only for his own shot. But he's more about team. Passes it to Deadman. On the wing, Jones. Teague against Smart. Good work defensively by Smart. Inside, here's Tatum, and slam dunk by Tatum. Another one from Tatum. I mean, boy, this kid, he's cooking at the offensive end. And it's Teague with the ball, but he brings it up for the Hawks. 11-point game. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. It's going to go on Gordon Hayward. All oh, the officials are all over that one. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. John Collins, he's checked in for Atlanta. 
Shemi Ojolay is checked in for the Celtics. And so T gets two free throws. Austin leading by nine. Walker goes in. Bucket is good. Walker's got 20 points. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Outside, Jones. Cohen's finds Jones. Outside, Teague. The Hawks again can't hit. On offense, here are the Celtics. They're on a 14-6 run. Uh, yeah, the footwork, the positioning. Tatum's a difficult cover inside. And falls for Tatum. Clint Capella, he's checked in for Atlanta. Young comes in for Jeff T. Both good from the line that time. The Hawks trail by 13. Young with the ball. Now guarded by Tatum. The pass to Herter. Launches a three. That's in. Coming off the assist from Young. Young's got his eighth assist here tonight. Boston's gone three or four from downtown here in the fourth. Young against Walker. For the three. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Walker's got 10 points in just the second half. Oh, you know Walker isn't going to let you get away with that. I mean, hit one on me, <laughs> I'm coming back at you. And Herter gets it to go. And they're showing much more focus here in the second half. More effort as well. And their offense starting to show signs of life. Now here's Walker. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Walker's got seven points for the quarter. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. <laughs> yeah, they're pouring it on right here. Trying to give the opposition no light at the end of the time. Here's Herder. Down low. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. And just a little too lax with that possession. And it cost them. Yeah, you got to be locked in at all times. Their inconsistent play is a big reason why they're losing. Austin making a switch here. Smart's checked in. Now here's Walker. Pass to Tice. Smart deciding where to go with it. Four on the shot clock. There's the steal. And they pick up two. Herter's got 24. And you know what? He's shaking off the cold shooting performance from the first half. Walker in the post. Young's there. And count it. The shot is good. He'll go to the free throw line. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. No good for Walker. No, for a player who won a national championship in college and has been outstanding since coming into the NBA, Walker may still rate as one of the game's more underappreciated players. And that one's good, Hunter. Now that's where you like your shots to come from. Austin leading by 10. Here's Walker. Count that one. He has 29. 
This quarter expending tremendous energy at the offensive end, and he's not slowing down. He's still calling for it. And Young kicks to Hunter. That's in coming off the assist from Young. Hunter's going to back down to within single digits for Atlanta. Walker against Young. Shots good by Walker. Walker's got 31. He does all the little things. I mean, he does the big things. I mean, he's got them in front with another outstanding performance. Hunter, no one around him. From outside, off the mark. Austin's gone to three-point range for 12 of their points in the final quarter on four of five shooting. Tatum with it. He's picked up by Collins. Tatum drives in. Lays it up off the glass. Tatum's got 15 points here in the second half. And gets hit on the drive. Excellent body control. Tatum's a well-coordinated athlete. Now, here's Hunter. Defended by Hayward. And that one's good. Hunter. 124 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Young against Walker. Outside Tatum. Pass to Hayward. Rebounded by Capella. Well, they'll be happy with that look, even though it didn't fall. No, you're right. You take that 10 out of 10 times. You're not going to miss many of those. Shooting two. So the first one drops, and that brings them to within 10. And he makes both free throws. Austin laden by nine. 55 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Shots good by Walker. And entering the final countdown, game four effectively decided here, guys. This is just a tremendous accomplishment for the Celtics. And it may be a comfortable win for him, but, you know, they had to weather a few storms along the way, and that's all part of the story. Yeah, Kevin, this was by no means the runaway that it might appear to be. It was a scrappy performance, though, all the way through. And as one might have guessed coming into this game, it was indeed another big game tonight for Kemba Walker. He was doing everything right, and the points came in bunches. Definitely had the hot heat. They get it back. Collins against Hayward. Collins kicks to Hunter. Lock at six. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't get the lid off. And here is Tatum. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. This was a crucial game for him, tying up the series at two apiece, Greg, a, a huge accomplishment. And this series, I think, hinged on who picked up game four, Kevin. I mean, now it's a three-game series, and anything can happen. Well, that'll do it for now. Glad you could join us during this first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA. Presented by 2K Sports. And we'll see you next time.